If you're looking for a coach that has a 20,000 pound towing capacity and the absolute best looking paint scheme of any Super C ever built with a Dean Laux custom design, you are in luck today. Doug Sewell, you've got something special for us today. What's going on, sir? Uh, look, I mean, I, I don't really have to say any words. If you just look behind me, you'll see exactly. 2016 DX3, 37 footer, it's the TS, which is triple slide. Uh, just, a, just a fantastic machine. Yeah, and you just picked this up. So you were telling me that you want to give us a couple different options. I think you, you probably overpaid for it because you got a little bit excited about that name right there oh, on it. There's no doubt about it. I definitely <laughs> overpaid for it. That's not my fault. That's, that, that's not your fault. That's my fault, folks. Uh, that doesn't mean I'm going to overprice it to you. If you're interested in this coach, I'll price this thing right. Get to the end of the video. Let's talk about that. Let me show you the flaws first because I want you to understand. Nothing major, just some oh, oh, cosmetic stuff. A Dynamax DX3. Yep. What floor plan is this? 37 TS, triple slide. You'll see when we open the slides up. Uh, fit only 15,000 miles. Incredible paint job. Just amazing. Glaring in the sun. That's probably my favorite paint scheme I've seen on a coach in a long time. Yeah, and it's got the higher profile. And I got to get you guys a close-up of all the stuff that Dean Laux Design has, like the big drop shadows and just the cool stencil work. There's just so much stuff going on in this paint job that the camera's not doing justice. You've got the metallic flake and that orange here and just different shades i mean dean laux if you know this name right here you know dean is responsible for changing the high-end motor coach to industry paint designs dean is the exclusive painter for liberty coach but still does the designs for dynamax and i did have a chance to tour the dynamax factory i'll leave a link to that video in the description below where Dean talks about his long time standing relationship with Dynamax and Dwayne, the president of Dynamax. And we're also gonna do another video test driving this coach. Definitely really solid driving. Very solid. Got your little Breaker 1.9 CB radio up here. I'll leave a link to that video in the description below, but Doug, what else is going on, sir? Well, I mean, it, we, you drove it, Andrew. You, you knew what. This is just an, an amazing driving machine. And a lot of people say that you can't get into the real nice RV resorts. We're down here at Mount Olive Shores North. They're, they're allowing the Super C in their resort, huh? Absolutely, yeah. I mean, you, you've got to buy a place with a covered storage here. You can put anything in there you want. Um, you know, I'll have to check the rules to see if you can have this on a pad. I think you can. I'll have to yeah, check they allow the Super C's in here. Yeah, I'll definitely let them in here. It's just there's some different rules. But anyway, you know, Elf, this this coach has aqua hot Andrew, uh, so it's not just a base down coach. This is this is a very well loaded twenty thousand pound towing capacity. Well, and the big thing about the Super C is not only the safety aspect of having that engine out front, but the serviceability. So let's just pop this open and take a look under the hood here. Now I'm going to point out one of the flaws. I'm going to point out the flaws as I see them. I do love that paint scheme up there, but if you look closely at the diamond shield, yep, it's this does need to be removed. It's starting to cracking, which if you have a diamond shield on the front of your coach, you know. So this is gonna have the Cummins. I love all the details they do, like the little chrome bezels around the headlights. We got these bays all opened up. You're gonna see the 50 amp reel here. Does have a, a power does have a power cord reel, but I think that might be one of the things that needs to get fixed. Here's a look at the sewer bay. And again, this is in the condition that it came to Doug in. So this coach has not been touched, but when I heard Doug had something with Dean Lauk's name on it, I just had to get my camera on this coach. Looks like the date codes on the tires are getting pretty close to needing to be replaced. I think these are the original tires. So probably time for a new set of michelins here it's got the cummins owning 8000 generator with 220 hours i like to see that they did run it a little bit but didn't overrun it here you've got a little bit of storage all easy to clean and this has not been detailed has not been touched here's your battery bank for your house batteries this bay is going to have a little bit of storage as well as your Zantrac inverter and your surge guard surge protection system. This coach does have the side cameras as well as the rear view camera, frameless windows. What kind of power plant do we have up here? It's 8.9 liter Cummins with the 350 horsepower, Andrew. 1,000 feet pounds of torque. It's got a 100 gallon fuel of 
carrying capacity. Also, your fresh water is 90 gallon in this coach. For any C or Super C, it's very uncommon. 90 gallon and then 45 or 55 and 55 on your fresh or your gray and black water. Yes, sir. No, no, you 16. Oh, it's beautiful. Yeah. yeah, it's nice. You ready to buy it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> he got to watch the class A in that. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> so this is something that Dean Laux always preaches. The, the, the saying at the Art of Design in Elkhart, Indiana is, can you handle the attention? We just pulled in here, at, what? two minutes and people were asking is about that, the is that brand new that's what i mean that's it looks it, it has the appearance of a brand new coach it's not a brand new coach folks but you know it looks like beautiful. it the neighbors thought it was so here's the back of the coach i'm looking forward to showing everybody inside that frameless window that you could see out your view of the back you've got the rear view camera up top there I love the DX3 and the Dynamax logos and just all that paintwork. This is just such a cool design that they do. You got storage back here. A lot of storage on this side of the coach, these big bays. There's your Aqua Hot 400 LP. Again, more storage and it's not carpet that's gonna stain. You can put some stuff in here and much easier to clean all kinds of storage on this side of the coach i like how they put all the systems on the other side of the coach and leave your bays open here but let's go show everybody inside of this coach yeah so right away i love this and if you want to see the coach with the slide outs in check out that test drive video and we'll show you what it's like with the slide outs in when i say we show them how effortless it is to put the slide outs out I'm not hearing any big noises or anything. And this is a triple slide coach? Triple slide. Two living room slides and a bedroom slide. Yeah, very effortless. Oh, it looks like that window is open too. Was that open while we were test driving? I think so. Yeah, so really effortless with those slide outs going in. I really, I'm liking this coach a lot. This is a lot of room in here. Yeah. And the other big advantage of these Super C's is the taller headroom. This is going to have more headroom than a lot of the Class A's. And this is a nice floor plan. I like the style. I kind of like European style recliners. And I'm going to go ahead and pull down these shades just because we've got some shadows coming in with all that sunlight. Real easy to use those MCD shades. we'll have to get some lights on in here but i want to point out when you open up this little cabinet you've got lighting in here and beautiful woodwork around the slide out faces and got some cabinets overhead here lined with carpet man this is a high-end coach for the number that you're about to tell these people yes what all else is going on in here sir uh you know super high-end luxury for a super c typically your super c outside of some of the late late model Numar products that are coming out more more recently but in 16 this was this is this was the beginning of the the super c craze in my opinion uh, you know this and this was super high end you got a couple super nice you got a couple really nice recliners over here uh and then you got a sofa across right next to a nice booth both of those are going to convert into beds uh, you do have two air conditioners and an onboard generator. Again, this is an aqua hot unit. Has a Xantrex inverter. Uh, you know, carefree awning. Little generator there. Little generator action. We'll get this power on. Nice TV up front here. So to be fully transparent, the leather is in pretty good condition. I see a little bit of wearing on the sides here, but not the end of the world. Two places real quick. The two front passenger seats are gonna need, they're gonna need recovery. Not too expensive to get that no. done, but just a little, I mean, or maybe put some seat covers on it, but not the end of the world, yeah. especially and, for the price. Doug as you pointed out over here, and then just real quickly, a couple little places where you got a, a oh, floor, yeah. floor I didn't even notice that. Yeah. I mean, that's minor minor stuff but a little crack on yeah, the tile just fully transparent to the to the folks there's a cup three or four of those that have some cracks in them where i'm looking i'm but looking yeah, i don't well, see them this color really helps hide that you know there's one here 
Oh, so, yeah. One over here by the refrigerator, or two by the refrigerator. So. All right, full full transparency yep. here. We're not just trying to hype you guys out, up. And... Outside of that, you got a, a door handle on a fridge that's that's busted, and I see why because walking by here, this really needs to be um, really doesn't need to have a handle on it at all. Yeah, um, kind of a poor design there with that refrigerator. Outside of that, Andrew, you're gonna find this coach to be in amazing condition, really and truthfully. And I can't find anything outside of those small cosmetic items. Yeah, check out the kitchen too. I love, love the color of these countertops and that backsplash is beautiful. Maybe get some more lights in there. Oh yeah. All the little details like the wine bottle holders, just that's super high end and that same backsplash. You've got outlets here in the wall, a little extra countertop space that pops up. Yeah, now going into the back of the coach, I like this floor plan with the sink off to your right here now. Where's the, where's the bathroom in? Is this this there. all is gonna be the bathroom? Looks like washer dryer here, Whirlpool washer and dryer, conveniently located right next to all of your wardrobe. But let's check out the bathroom here. You've got a good size radius shower, a lot of space around your toilet there. Nice little room with your your head and your shower all in one spot. You've got a vent up there little storage up here and this is in really good condition you can tell you know other than those little things it was pretty well cared for overall this is a very rich and luxurious feel back here you've got your tv and look how flush that tv is how it looks like it's almost part of the cabinetry you've got the real dark wood there's a little bit of wardrobe space there you have some storage above the tv as well as some drawer space here and then you're going to have a lot more wardrobe here. So we know, Doug and I both know, this is going to be hers wardrobe. And then this is going to be his wardrobe. Right, Doug? Hey, Amen to that. Yeah, your, your, your wife's <laughs> taking the big closet? Well, she deserves it. She has to put up with me. <laughs> yeah, true story. <laughs> king size bed? You know, I, I don't know the dimensions of it, but it certainly feels like a king size bed. A little to me. wider. Yeah, it, it might be a junior king. It's but... definitely bigger than a queen and, uh, and very comfortable, too. It's a really nice. Yeah, and I like, you know, that's the shape of the mattress. It's not all you know, yellow stains or anything. You could tell this coach has been cared for. I got to give everybody a, a close up on that diamond texture the diamond stitching on the headboard all right doug so you said you didn't know how to price this you could price it a couple different ways yeah. let's well, i'll tell you what let's sit down and talk you found us a dean laux design super c yep i've been trying to get my camera on one of these since i started the youtube channel almost three years ago yep. so you could sell this two different ways what are what are well, the options the, the market says this coach is worth 219. this coach here i probably went above and beyond where i really felt comfortable paying that's not your fault to your viewers that's not your fault i'm not going to overcharge not going to try to overcompensate with a larger price the market says this coach is worth 219,000. it's got some flaws if you as you've seen if you want to buy this coach the way it is right now it's sitting in florida i'm going to park it in storage it's going to sit here for about a week or two before i have a chance to get back down here to florida to pick it up so if you're watching this video Call me if you're interested. I'll sell you this coach for $199, 999 Wow. The, the market says it's worth $220. we are not playing any games. If you're interested in this coach, you can buy it for two hundred grand right now. Just give me a call. As is. As is, yeah. As, no, as don't let that scare you because this coach runs and drives great. I don't really think it needs much. Any Maybe a service. A maybe, detail. Maybe a detail. Throw Slap some tires on it. If you want to fix some floor tiles, you can do that you know you be the judge on the furniture a few little list items now if we get this thing back to kentucky in a couple weeks and we start fixing it obviously we're going to go 220 on the coach yeah okay. and then yeah and, and you'll probably get new tires yep. uh will you get that diamond shield removed that's an diamond. expensive yeah it's 1500 bucks or actually probably a little less on this because it's not quite as much material as you'd see on a class a yeah uh 1500 1800 bucks to 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 remove that and put it back on so it sounds like they can buy it as is for 200 or if they want to wait have you go through the coach more yep 220 but i think you could take this coach and camp it at tomorrow uh, 2015 yeah. date code tires i mean those are getting on the age of seven you years. you want to put some new tires yeah. i would put new tires yeah, over me personally yeah. they're in great shape i mean you know they're not dry rotted or any of that stuff but 
If you're ready to buy this coach, reach out to me on my cell phone, Andrew, 859-613-2574. How about financing? Can Fi you get financing? Can you Absolutely. take in trades? Absolutely. Financing, trade-ins, uh, we can handle all that. We, lo we love trade-ins. We, we, we have great financing sources. We, do, we handle that for you in our finance department. We're not just telling, giving you a phone number to call to handle the financing. We're actually going to handle the financing and get you approved ourselves. Trading? Do you like trades? Love trade-ins. Any kind of trade, up or down. If you're ready to go from a class A to a C because you're hauling 20,000 pounds, uh, you know, give me a call. I'd love to take a trade on on, a, on anything. Greatly appreciate you finding this one. Yep. I think this is the result of you watching too much YouTube and <laughs> having being a big fan of Dean Locks. But I think there's value there. I mean, those people just walked up to us and said, is this coach brand new? You couldn't Absolutely. have made that up. Nope. And nope. That's right. But, uh, but, man, can't thank you enough for getting this coach to show the viewers on YouTube. Greatly appreciate you and the team at Sewell Motor Coach. Yep. I also greatly appreciate all of you out there on YouTube subscribing to the channel and liking these videos. I hope you're all having a great day. Thanks again. Thank you all. Check out the website for pictures and information, SewellMotorCoach.com. You'll have a wonderful and blessed day.